So a customer dropped off their PC today for arguably one of the most annoying blue screens. Basically, every time we turn on the PC, it doesn't even get into Windows and just keeps saying critical process died. When stuff like this happens, it's pretty easy to repair. I mean, I usually just do system restore, uninstall any latest quality updates, or try enabling it with safe mode. No matter what I tried, nothing seemed to help and I kept getting the same blue screen over and over again. When stuff like this happens, the easiest thing you can do is just wipe the SSD and reinstall Windows on it. Unfortunately, our customer had a lot of important information that he didn't want to erase, so we had to go and try something else. Over here, I'm using command prompt to try to do a system restore. Without doing this, I kept getting the same system restore error, so I'm hoping this one fixes the it. The good news is that it finds the right file to restore, but the bad news is that it doesn't work. After doing everything possible to fix this corrupted Windows issue, our customer was only left with two options. Wipe your hard drive, reinstall Windows, and lose everything, or get a new M.2 and install Windows on that. So he's got some extra storage now, he has all of his old files, and there's no more blue screening.